It's definitely not those situations. Okay. But the next matchup. That's right. We have Charlie the King, who overcomes Zenyu, uh, is now be playing against Eon for loser semis. So this is for fourth place. Yeah, and Charlie was the first seed of this tournament. Fun fact. But the uh, he got upset in winner semis by Luna. Wow, so. Yep. I believe Luna is waiting in losers finals, right? That's right. So if Charlie, in fact, is able to overcome Eon, then he'll get his run back against Luna, and which leaves a uh, Larry Lur in grand finals. Bro, the cloud buffs though, like, no. <laughs> like they. I could talk oh. about cloud buffs all day, baby. I, I mean, we we are gonna have that in losers finals, but I mean, this is a good matchup too. Definitely. Mm -hmm. uh, I feel like a lot of people have asked me about this matchup because I play both characters. I do feel like Wolf wins. But like, how hard does he win, though? Not, it, it, it's either even or Wolf wins slightly. It's, be, it's between those two, pretty much. Okay. So, okay. Uh, I think Wolf just messes up Fox really hard in disadvantage. He just needs to get one hit and Fox... Oh, goes. yeah, he's not coming back. Yeah. Like, I mean, Wolf can two-frame Fox pretty easily on reaction. Okay, probably doesn't get it there. But, yeah, he's trying to go for the big like, so instead of just going for the F-Tilt. Well, right. And I mean, the down smash is good to go there because he can die. <laughs> yes, you yes, know I mean? yes. Like, Fox is on the killing menu at 40% here for Wolf, so. Oh, man, that's tasty. But, but Fox has some of the best neutral in the game. Um, he's so quick. He, he's the fastest faller, so he jumps up to the ground. He can fall back down really quick. There's a lot of Tomahawk mix-ups when it comes to Fox. Okay. Getting the wrong roll read, but okay, trying to go for the extended F tilt, but in fact, Eon getting the illusion into an up air. Charlie the King getting a fourth or retaking stage control, F tilt whiffing. Oh, he just barely did it too early there. Eon gonna get back onto stage. Okay, the Nair, okay. I, I don't know, he probably called out a jump throw. A couple of down tilts, okay, was his down throw? Now Eon, oh, oh, the reflect back though. Four tilt doesn't clip it. Oh, the back air sneaks above the grab from Charlie, and Eon is going to take the lead. I thought you said that move didn't kill. What the <laughs> heck, hey, man? man? He was at 140. Hey, what, what the heck? He was at 140, <laughs> all right? Okay. And speaking of 140, Eon, you know, sitting above 140 at 157. He's just one F tilt away, one up tilt away. Dash attack. There's so many things that's going to kill Charlie here, or um, kill Eon here. Oh, but the, yeah, this back throw. Back throw. See ya. Yeah, he went for the up smash there. He thought it was true, but Wolf does have a frame two air dodge. So there's some combos that are going to be true on other characters with frame three air, dodge, air dodges, but sometimes won't be true on spaces or other two frame air dodges. Yeah, must be nice. But I did <laughs> see that good stall from Eon. He used the shine to just chill in the air for a bit, which actually messed up the space from Charlie. He was looking for that raw back air, but just whipped completely, allowing Eon to make it back to stage. What are these hops oh, in each other's faces? At 50. He got hit at 50% and died with. And that was like from falling fair. That's a really like good move. Caught out the double jump and Eon, he got the sweet spot bear too. That's the only bear hitbox that would have killed in that situation. So he had to make sure he spaced it perfectly. And wow, Charlie looking really clean this game one. That was that was a crazy game, dude. That's right. But okay, so if you were a match, if you were a fan of the Spaces match, uh, that's gone. <laughs> no, Eon. It's it's out of here. You so do, okay, you know what? I, I respect this. Eon. I you gotta respect it. Like this is a better pick. Yeah, yeah. This is a this is a better pick for sure. But I mean, Joker just got like semi nerfed. It was I wouldn't say it, it wasn't too bad. Arson get nerfed. A little bit. <laughs> a little bit. Arsen, so, so essentially, um, Arsen doesn't last as long um, by a little bit. And uh, down gun the hitbox. That was probably the biggest nerf. That hitbox is gigantic. Mm -hmm. So three patch down gun. So yeah. I think about it. I don't see Joker's use down gun as often. Yeah. I mean, it could be because of the. Uh, I mean, you're still gonna like use it, but yeah. I mean, it's definitely not as good as use. Yeah, definitely a little bit more more side B action coming from, uh, from the Jokers. Okay, we're trying to take the back here, gets the Tomahawk, the down pop, pop. gun again. Oh, he tries to reflect instead of going for a second down gun there. Charlie just gonna rinse and repeat, but he gets back on, wait. Oh, but he snatches him back up. Doesn't yes. die, but right in the same spot. Actually, you know what? That actually kind of worked out for Eon. While he was having uh, Arsene out, he was just kind of getting stuck in the blender from Charlie. As soon as Arson went away, he was able to make it back to stage. Unfortunately, Charlie getting the able to clean up the stock regardless. But double dash attack? No, just a single dash attack. Went for the tech chase. Yeah, 
Char Charlie's getting a lot cleaner on parries, man. Um, that's one thing. I mean, Charlie has been doing so amazing recently, mm -hmm. right? Just really taking a lot of these SoCal tournaments. And even at a... Uh, he got ninth at Genesis. Genesis yeah, ninth at Genesis. And he was up to one on Meister, too. That was a really crazy set. Okay, Arson's out. Here we go. Game time. Yep. Down tilt is enough. Uh, 200%. Yeah, All right, Charlie, right wait it out. Stay on the platform. Thank you. Yes. All right. We're in there, boys. Plus the nerf. <laughs> Hey man, I'm just, I'm just, make, I'm just making sure we're all playing clean out here, okay? <laughs> Whose coach are you? <laughs> we're all playing clean out Wait, here. What's that? What's that tag in front of your name? Is that, <laughs> is that Charlie Korean? <laughs> all right, wait, but the drag down up there doesn't connect. The board smash, the lean back, kind of avoiding mm -hmm. that down tilt, really good stuff. I mean, that lean back has been messing up players since day one of Ultimate. Just pretty much any move that where it's kind of auto space your yourself, just forces your opponent to whiff and then free punish. Oh yeah. Sure. Back throw. Charlie still isn't taking too much damage here. Oh, tries to get the call out, but the get up attack getting Eon out. An option that we don't see like too often from the higher level players either. They usually like oh, have you, escape on their mind, but you have to have that option. I feel like everyone gets at least one, like per game. <laughs> everyone gets like you get away with get up attack at least once per game. Okay, well the tomahawk up till. I like I, Charlie's been doing that a lot, and it's so good because if someone goes for a parry or if they jump out of shield, you kill them. You're covering like a lot of really good options. Hey, you're right. That's that's actually not okay. Yeah, it's really good. I mean, <laughs> obviously, and as, if you do it behind them, usually it's like semi-safe. You know, obviously, characters with good outshield behind can still mm -hmm. get you. But oh, the back air. But Eon spaces it, kind of drifts back, gets him with his back air of his own. Counter. Oh, yeah, going for the counter. But I don't know. I'm starting to think guns is maybe the better option. Yeah, guns are. Wow, the guns with the back air. Can you finish it off? The forward air, but Charlie saves his jump. They both get back on the stage, but Eon is the one with the center stage control. Forward Ooh. smash. Forward throw oh. into up smash. Wow, with the hardest of roll reads. Yeah. Knowing exactly where Eon was going to end up. Yeah, and it's like. It's so scary rolling away from Wolf in that situation because if you roll away any dash attacks, you die. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And then there's the whole, like. If I just miss tech or tech in place, he could down smash it too, right? So there's so many things that kill you in that situation. Yeah, Charlie's been getting back, a lot of dash attack. Oh yeah. no, man! Charlie's been getting a lot of people for rolling in. Like he'll even do it like a roll read to the extent of like forward smashing the other way. Like, you know what I mean? Dang. Just to be like, you're gonna roll through me. Dang! Gonna smash Dang! <laughs> All right. Gets, like, early Big brain that. Charlie. Well, the thing is too is like if you catch them rolling when you hit them with an F smash like that, their mm -hmm. DI is bad too. Oh, you're right, because yes. he's already holding yes. forward. like, I've seen Charlie blow people up with that option. Up there, up there oh, again. Oh. Ooh, into the back air. Clean 84%. Charlie's combos on Wolf are so clean. I say this all the time. Charlie is the best Wolf when it comes to conversion. Three. Yeah. Oh, okay, but Charlie King trying to set up at the ledge, and guess what? He got the big stomp from, <laughs> from Eon, of course, answering right back. Charlie the King with a revenge kill. Yeah, it's just so hard in those situations. That's the that's the make or break situation because you're fighting your opponent with intangibility, right? Right. So it's like, dang, I can't swing back. Like, I just have to live this situation. But usually, you're automatically like in a disadvantage, like, advantage, like in the corner or something, you know? Okay. Oh, the call out on the jump. No jump here. Wait for Oh, us. answer wow. him back. What is this? Wow. Calls <laughs> out the counter on reaction. Punishes him with the dare. What a turnaround from Charlie. Okay, I need, I need more oh! guns, more guns, more guns. I mean, you can still make it back. His, you have to finish it off. Okay, there it is, the forwarder. If he didn't finish that, he could have side feed. So really good stuff. Just really putting the cherry on top. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got to. Eon is uh, is definitely very comfortable going very deep for those these kills. Okay, but here it comes. Arson is out. Oh, but Get Eon has been so close both games, you know what I mean? Like, I just feel like if Eon can take this game three, it'll give him the confidence for like, that the reverse 3-0 because oh, he's been sure. so close for the, for the first two games. This game is falling kind of behind, but Arsene is about to run out. I mean, even think about that interaction right there. He was fall Eon was falling on Charlie with guns. Normally, Jokers especially, and Eon would throw out a back air, just apply pressure on shield, and just maybe try to get escape. But he just landed on Charlie with guns and then grabbed him. The confidence is huge. Okay, down gun. He goes for it again, but comes with the back air. Tries to get the drop zone, but Charlie with the double jump early. Yeah, double jumping right back to center stage too, but Nair out of shield is going to put Eon at the ledge. And he get out the down gun. Wow, Ooh. Charlie with the confidence to just parry the down gun into dash attack. I like that. Again, um, Charlie getting really clean with his parries, and it's netting him so many stocks. True, but now we've both our players pretty much at even percent. Ooh, oh, oh. Oh. The spot dodge. That's special. 
They, uh, it's crazy that they haven't been spot dodging too much. Okay. The neutral game between these two has been insane. You can see Charlie is just on the hunt, but Eon's making it very difficult to, to get that one confirm. Oh! Oh, wait, the forward tilt? Is it yeah, enough? That's yeah. enough. Yeah, he was rage. at 150 before yeah. he got hit. Yeah. Especially with the rage, too. And, and you're on stadium. 